Here's another Keepsake Crafts video for House of Gems. Today we are making earrings that have beautiful dangles all wire wrapped onto a gold plated hoop. To make these earrings you will need first of all to pick out the rings that you're going to use. I chose these 10 millimeter gold plated twisted looking rings. Uh, keep in mind that the bigger the ring you choose the bigger beads you can use. You want to keep them in proportion. So for the beads, for the focal, I chose these eight, uh, they're eight by six millimeter uh, crystals, faceted crystals, and then for the accents I chose these little three millimeter frosted beads. And you want your rings to be soldered closed. A closed ring will be security for your earrings. You'll also need two ear wires You'll need 10 of these little accent beads, by the way, 10 plain head pins, and two decorative head pins. And then for tools, you'll need chain nose pliers, wire cutters, round nose pliers, and if you like, optional, a pair of crimping pliers. I'll show you what to do with those. So the first step is to wire wrap your beads. So here's my main focal, and I'm just going to slide that onto one of the decorative head pins and then grasp it with chain nose pliers right where the wire comes out of the bead and make a 90 degree bend. Tuck in my round nose pliers into that bend. Start the wrap. You'll only get about that far and then reposition the pliers so you can finish the wrap. The important thing here is that you stop at this point and don't complete the wrap until you've slid it onto your ring. That's what secures it. So go ahead and just twist that a little bit so that it's open and you can slide it onto your ring. And then grasp that loop with chain nose pliers and you can close it now where you twisted it open and hold it. And then use another pair of chain nose pliers to hold that wire end and wrap that wire around. I'm just going to make that a little nicer there around the wire that's above the bead. A great thing about wrap loops is they're very secure. If you have a soldered ring and a wrap loop, you're not going to lose your bead. So we use wire cutters to trim the excess wire and if there's a little tail of wire poking up, this is where the round bit of crimping pliers comes in handy. Use the rounded part on the, near the tips and you can just round that little end of wire over. And then repeat putting the accent beads on the plain head pins and wire wrap five accent beads on each of the rings and it should look like this. And now I'm going to put two accent beads, slide two on one side and three on the other. And the last step is to use chain nose pliers to open up the loop. Oh, it's on the other side. It's usually on the inside. Open up the loop of your ear wire. Make sure we've got two on one side and three on the other. Slide in your ring and then make sure that loop is closed securely. And there you have it, a really cute and simple pair of dangle earrings.